Nerdy Nerf here with another review and Nerf mod. Today will be a Nerf mod. Alright, I'm showing you how to prepare a Nerf barricade. Or the first step of doing it. Of making a barricade. Have it be able to use clips. Hold up. So, anyway. Nerdy Nerf here. I've already said that. Now, you need this piece that comes on a raider. It'll have two prongs that poke up at this end. And it'll have these things that lock the raider in place. It'll have four of those. You want to remove this that comes out of these two holes. What should come out there, you do undo those two screws. Or the screws in there. Two little holes. And this should come out and a spring should come out and then out of these these four holes you should have four of these little locking hinges now I wouldn't suggest taking your Raider apart just to use this piece now if you have a Raider that doesn't work like me I let a friend hold a, good, a perfectly good Raider and he messed it up um, names are anonymous so but anyway, the point is that I'm using this for a Nerf Barricade. Now, I personally don't have a Nerf Barricade yet, but I'm getting one, and this is a probably, I'm showing you how to start to make it able to use clips. So, alright, after you remove all of this orange crap, you will want to start cutting these uh, raised pieces off. Now I've already done three of them and I have my Dremel that I did a review on that I got for Christmas. Um, I'm already starting to Dremel it down. So I'll show you how to do that. Turn your Dremel on and should look like this when you're done and you'll take this piece and snap it off and then you also want to clean up clean it clean it up a little bit you know just to get those little burrs off So yeah, that's how you do it. Um, you probably want to trim the blast, the just the shell itself down just a little bit more. just trim it up just a little bit not very much you don't want to trim it so much that you actually tear up tear it actually up but you want to trim it just barely enough to where 
it, you'll make it fit into your barricade. And see, yeah. See, it slides in like that right there. This is how it should look, and when you push this. You take the Raider piece. See, it's not going in here. Whoops. And this one. And I'll get some other clips to prove that it works. Uh, I have uh, the most common clips. Six. I have six. I have 18. Which is a lot longer than a normal clip. And I have YouTube's three round clip. I have the Alpha Trooper 18 round clip that actually holds 20 darts if people that own this did not know. And I will be showing you how the Raider piece works with all of these different types of clips. not going anywhere. Rattle, but it's not going anywhere until you hit the clip release. Three round. Definitely not going anywhere. You're going to have to push this one because the way I designed it has hot glue and the hot glue catches. A lot of people, they don't even use a, a bolt there. They just uh, put a piece of something right here and the spring rests against the bottom. So, I, I just done it the easiest way that I personally thought way it would work. See? And... Not going anywhere. Oh, I hit the clip button. Alright, so that's how you prepare your barricade to shoot streamlined darts or any other type of darts and clip form. Alright, see ya. Nerdy Nerf, see you next video.